this Aaron Wilson is. Wait a minute. Kessel, it's a woman. E-R-I-N. She's serving seven years in federal prison for felony computer trespassing. So she's a hacker, too. Court records show that she hacked a database at the New York Federal Reserve looking for proof that the Fed colluded with big banks. What's her connection to Stone? It looks like Jared Stone was an accomplice, but the U.S. attorney didn't have enough to charge him. So they were partners in crime. Aaron went to prison. Stone didn't. That's why he wants to get her out. He feels guilty. That would also explain the Maldives. What do you mean? It's an non-extradition country. Hey, guys, you need to see this. But what was in that shredder was about two pages of text. So far, we've been able to assemble a few random words like monitor and surveillance. OK, what do you think it is? It's some kind of letter. But I don't think that Stone was the one who wrote it. Take a look at this phrase that we assembled just now. Read, memorize, and then destroy? It's not like he would write that to himself. So there are instructions. Now we know Stone is working with other people. Maybe this is all about Aaron Wilson. Maybe she's the one behind all this. Castle and I will look into Aaron Wilson and dig deeper, and we'll also see if we can identify any associates that Jared might have had. We'll keep piecing this together here. Guys, everyone down there is counting on us. <laughs>